Violet Claydon held her son's hand in a Middle East hospital as he died. Weeks later, she led mourners at his funeral at Beerley in Warwickshire. Lance Corporal Paul Muirhead was shot during a Taliban attack in Afghanistan in September 2006. He was 29. As with many families of the fallen, Violet's world collapsed. Everything just seems to shut down and you just lose total interest in doing anything, even in the house. Which is where Bill McCants comes in. He founded Forces Support, a charity which takes in second-hand furniture and resells it via a network of shops like this one in Kidderminster. The profits are then used to repair, renovate and refurbish the homes of those left behind. I was actually looking for some help for a friend who lost someone in Afghanistan, um, which is where I found that there was none of this type of help out there, nothing available. That really is when it, it started or when the seeds were sown. This shop has been trading for about a year and was the fourth one to open, but the charity has just doubled that figure to eight. But it says by 2015, it wants 50 shops all over the country. Paul Muirhead's family now has a replacement patio after the old one became uneven and unsafe. There's also a new fence and garden gate. But Violet says Forces Support is much more than just a group of well-meaning tradesmen. It's just chatting to them as well. Having them here um, actually lifted up my spirits. The shooting dead of 26-year-old Lance Corporal Liam Tasker and the death just hours later of his search dog Theo made national headlines in March last year. Liam was based at barracks in North Luffenham in Rutland and had been in Afghanistan for just six months. After his death, his mother and two sisters returned to their native Scotland but have only just found somewhere permanent to live. The family called on Forces Support, who immediately dispatched a team to help get the place habitable. We've lived with my mum for the past 19 months since Liam was killed, so we've literally been homeless and we got given this house last week, but it was just so much work needed doing and Bill sent his team up like, and they've just been amazing. I mean, we, we wouldn't have been able to move in if it wasn't for the lads. Competition for every charity pound is tough, but Forces Support is getting a reputation for a fair deal on second-hand furniture and word about exactly what they do is getting around. My God, you couldn't get a three-piece suite for that price, could you? Well, I come in here pretty regular and I bring things for the shop and the staff do a wonderful job as well. The charity recently received a donation from the Duchy of Cornwall at the personal request of Prince Charles. But the giving works both ways. Violet has just raised £2,000 for the charity at a memorial event for Paul. Families of the fallen finding a helping hand at their most desperate time, but also finding a way to move on and put their lives back together. Andy Bevan, Central Tonight.